How could something as simple as a golf glove create fatigue? This is Golf Smarter. It's working with the anatomy of your hand. What Dr. Jim did when he designed bionic technology is he put pads in the areas where you have low spots between your joints. So in essence, he's filling in for a more even surface. And as you know, golfers tend to put the death grip on the glove. Isn't that why we go through gloves? Is because of that death grip? (laughs) And you can still squeeze tightly, but you don't have to because the pads are evening that surface out for you. And it's forcing you to have a lighter grip. And you're not fatiguing your hand. So if you have that death grip on your club, then that's going to slow down your swing speed because all that tension is going up your forearm and you're not nice and fluid. When you are more relaxed and you're swinging freely, the ball goes farther, doesn't it? Absolutely. There are some golfers that put the butt of the club right where this bone called the hook of the handmaid is. And you can't really feel it, but if you fell on it, that's probably the first thing that would break. The friction over time that's grinding against that area of your hand eventually wears a hole in your glove. Mm -hmm. So when you see worn gloves, that's usually where you see it. Click on the link below to subscribe to our free weekly interviews on the Golf Smarter podcast at golfsmarter.com.